Secondhand off a guy from from Austria, Aqua Computing Cryos Upro Cryos Cryos Cuplex Cuplex Cryos Cuplex uh, pure copper. Um, but uh, I tried to clean this already. I just put it back in a box for safekeeping uh, in anticipation of getting my the other equipment that I needed to put my 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 loop together. Excuse me. So today I am going to disassemble this and use the old lemon lemon juice trick to clean clean the block. So it comes apart. There's two uh, gaskets here and I want to be careful that I don't damage this one in particular. There we go. Catch it. There we go. So be careful with that. And, and there we have it. So it's pretty clean inside but uh, I just want to make sure I get everything nicely done. So I'm going to pour I'm going to put these, just oops, these screws in here, and then add this in there too, and then like that. Keep it submerged for a couple of hours, and then we'll come back and See the results, hopefully that's going to be very nice. Be good. So, we'll be back in two hours. Let's see how it, uh, see how it went. Okay, so it's been a couple of hours. And uh, it looks pretty good in there. So I hope that's done. Got a little toothbrush here. Sort of... Off anything that might still be there. Wow, that's awesome. Oh, look at the inside though. That's just that's just pure. Okay, I think I can live with that. Still a little staining here that didn't come off. It's been I think two and a half hours. So I'm gonna just uh, rinse that off. in there with like almost like a loop when I first got it but before using the lemon juice because I really wanted to make it as clean as possible. That looks pretty darn good. Live with that. Okay so that's that. I rinse this off too. It looks like there's a bit of stain in Okay. Yeah, that looks gorgeous in there though. That's amazing. And then there's these. I don't even know why I used I did that. I'm just gonna use those off in a minute. 
And I got the little screws here, just to, just cause, get those off too. Sink. <laughs> that would be a disaster. So those can go here as well. There, and that's it. And I just wanted to mention also, this is the the Socket 2011 version 3. Um, that's the, the uh, I, don't know, well, I don't know what to call it, the legs. I call it my, the legs in my head. But they're um, the uh, connection, tie down on it. Uh, whatever they are. So I got the, I got those and these have like springs and you can't over tighten them. So that's that's gonna be replacing those. And I also got a new a new thing. I think this this is critical. Like I just didn't want to reuse the old one because um, it's just I, you know it's probably still good but I may have nicked it but I, I don't know if I did. And I just just better safe than story. I mean this is this is the point of contact between the water. Uh, so that's the gasket, that's all important. So I think, I think airing on the side of a fresh gasket is the way to go. It still feels elastic. So it's probably still good, but I would, I would rather have a fresh one with a fresh thing and do everything we can to move from there. All right, well that's it. Thanks for watching, bye for now. Thank <laughs> you.